What's up guys, PBD here and welcome to another episode of the Trophy Count. Today's tournament is the Blue Blank, a rogue, and that translates to blue, white, and red. Obviously, the name of the French national team. And obviously, the requirements for this tournament were to have a French team. And yes, it is another French tournament. We had a tournament that was both Portugal and France. Then we had a Portugal tournament, and now we have a France tournament. You gotta love EA's cre creativity, but I had to buy back the players I used the last time we played with a French team, and I went with the same exact team because if I've won it before with that team, I'm pretty sure I can win it again with the same team. So we head into the final, and our opponent has a nice little 4 3 3 2 side right there. He has uh, pretty good wingers there. I've never actually played with Coleman, I don't think so. I wanted to see how he would play against us. And our opponent would have the first chance of the game over here in the 17th minute. We clear it off the line with our shortest player in the team, Val Buena, right there, which was a bit surprising. And Lloris ends up with the balls in his hand, and uh, we don't concede. In the 26th minute, though, our opponent would try to create another chance. However, Pogba does come back, steals it for us, and from that we go on the attack, gives it to Payet, Payet to Valbuena, Valbuena with a great pass to Griezmann, and Griezmann finishes it very nicely on his right foot to give us the 1-0 the lead, and I'm just so glad I built the same team because I love Valbuena, and I feel like throughout the whole tournament I didn't see too many teams with Valbuena in it, but he was... Honestly, one of the best players in the team, and you can see right here, he's got the skills, he's got the pace. Obviously, he doesn't have the height, but uh, he kind of makes up for everything with his uh, pace and skills and everything. So, if you don't mind playing with a small player and you're building a French team, I definitely recommend Valbuena. And right there, our opponent somehow doesn't equalize. It goes through our defender's legs on an open net. And it goes wide. I couldn't believe it when I saw it. It was the 45th minute, so I'm like, yeah, that's going to be a goal. So when it went wide, I'm like, what? How did he miss that? But yeah, we head into the second half with a 1-0 lead. Our opponent is actually kind of dominating us, as you saw right there. He has way more possession. He's had more chances. But we're holding on, and we're looking for that second goal over here. And in the 57th minute, we would have a chance at that second goal. A great pass to Lacazette, who joins Griezmann on the score sheet, makes it 2-0. And with that, we have a nice little 2-0 lead in the 60th minute. And not too long after that goal, it was going to be time for a change because we always do uh, subs around this minute. So it was time to bring on some fresh legs and hopefully score a third goal. And over here, we go ahead and take off, I believe, uh, Payet, I think I took off right there for a more defensive sub as we bring on Matuidi. However, it wouldn't be needed because not much happened after that goal. And with that, we were crowned the champions of the Blue Blank Aero tournament. And yeah, something France unfortunately couldn't uh, do in real life, uh, lift the trophy right there. But yeah, we get 5,000 coins, we get a mystery pack, and of course, another trophy for the cabinet. A pretty tense final and just happy to have come out on top. But once again, we go ahead and open the mystery pack. Can this be the time? Yes, it is. We finally get a draft token. Anyways, guys, that's going to conclude this episode of the Trophy Cabinet. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Pippi Deed, and I'm out. I lost the first round, by the way, of the draft, if you cared.